Congratulations. Uh, if you could just give us a snapshot of your day. Uh, coming off of the, the morning time, you really saw the performance there in the 110s. Uh, how did you feel after that one and then uh, getting ready for the 300s and going out and executing a fine time there today? Obviously, after running the 1458, felt great. You know, great start to the day. Uh, I know it's going to come back and really get after on the 300s. So I kind of, in between there was late you know, lunch, looking forward to the threes, trying to get ready. And then came out here, 38.9. Great time, I'll take that for today. <laughs> I was gonna say, when you see the, the times, and so far they've been very impressive this season. Um, again, it's mid-March, so obviously a long way to go in the season, but gotta feel good about where you are training-wise, and now with the wins too, confidence-wise as well. Definitely, I, definitely, I don't want to get faster from going out in the season. Yeah, I think that uh, the training at my school has been doing a great job of getting us ready for a second half of the season. Obviously, I know there's never a perfect performance, and even though the times are great, I know you'll probably go back and say, man, I wish I could have done this. Uh, what would you say were maybe a couple things that uh, you still feel as though you can improve upon and even get those times lower? Uh, for the 110s, just uh, like I talked about earlier, hitting my ankle on the trail leg, coming over on a few, that's just that's time, just place it right there. Uh, but for the 300s, so trying to get my left leg more, really. Got my off leg on so seven of them. The so I started working on opening up my stride and trying to hit all of them with my left. Obviously, with strong early season performances, uh, there's notoriety that comes with that. And then there's uh, expectation levels that rise. How do you feel about that? Is that something that you know doesn't bother you? You can just go out and push it out? Do you kind of feel like, hey, I need to go out and have a strong performance every time? I think I. I think I deal with it pretty well. I'm able to kind of not let it get to me or put too much pressure on myself. Kind of able to just block it out before the race. Just be mentally ready. Obviously ready to perform well here today. Again, Roman Mendoza, 110 hurdles champion, win legal 1458. Comes back 3890 in the 300 meter hurdles. Roman, congratulations. Uh, excellent job. And uh, we look forward to seeing you down the line. Thank you.